Hi everyone, welcome to Newegg TV. My name is Paul and this is the Netgear XA VB5004 Universal Internet Adapter. Now this internet adapter is designed for home entertainment and Netgear is telling us that it is specifically useful for 3D displays. Uh, what this actually is is a power line internet adapter. Uh, you get these two devices you can see here which you connect to the existing power plugs in your home and then you can use it to transmit data from one area of your home to another. Uh, you can use it to connect internet ready TVs, Blu-ray players, or game consoles to your broadband internet. So again, 3D capable. It is also capable of streaming full HD 1080p. Uh, you can connect up to four devices to the included uh, network hub and you get power line internet connection of up to 500 megabits per second. Flipping around here to the back, they're giving you some more details on the same information, but as you can see, uh, based on this little diagram down here, uh, you connect the XAV5001 unit to a wall adapter, connect that to your router, and then the router connects to the internet. Then it uses the existing electrical wiring in your home. The XAV5004 unit can then uh, plug into several or up to four different devices, such as a Blu-ray, DVR, HDTV, or game console. You also get a one-year warranty from Netgear with this device. Uh, taking a look inside the box, you get a setup disk. So there you have some included software on this resource CD. Um, here's the back of it. You also get some other information about other Netgear products, the connected lifestyle, um, also a diagram of a home there, and what you can do to set up your home with Netgear products to make sure everything's wired up you have the ability to access your content from wherever you might be. Uh, here's the installation guide for this particular product, as long as an overview of the package content, information on tech support uh, from Netgear, also troubleshooting. We give you a description of the various LED notifications you can get on the device, so you can uh, determine uh, what's going on. And then finally, a diagram of uh, installing everything to make sure that you're plugging in the right components to make use of this device. So here is the, uh, the hub right here, and we'll come back to that in just a moment to give you guys a closer look. Also inside the box, they've provided a couple Ethernet cables. Here is a power plug and cable for the AV500 uh, gigabit power line adapter. And that's about it for inside the box accessories. So the two main components here are your power line adapters, and this is the XAV5001 or AV500. As you can see there, uh, it's got a few uh, LED lights on the front that will indicate, for instance, if you have power, uh, your power line status, and your network status. Uh, you also have a factory reset button that's there on the side, so if you have any difficulties, you can hit that factory reset to go back to square one and get your, uh, get your power line internet connection set up again. Uh, so this device, you're going to plug into the wall, and actually, um, using these LED lights, you can determine uh, which wall socket actually has the best uh, connection speed. Uh, there's more information on that in the manual. Once you have this plugged in, you're going to uh, use the Ethernet plug here on the bottom to connect to your existing home router, and uh, that will basically share the power line internet connection uh, coming from the router with the other devices on the power line connection. And uh, specifically, that would be this four port power line AV500 adapter, also known as XAVB5004. As you can see, it's got a glossy black finish. And this is the one that actually has the hub in the back. Before I get to that, let me talk about the front. Uh, you do, again, have those same uh, indicator lights there. And again, those will light up uh, different lighted, uh, different colors will indicate different statuses. Again, more information on that in the manual. Uh, flipping over here to the bottom, you can see it's got some rubber feet, uh, so you can set that. Uh, wherever you most prefer. Uh, best to have this, uh, for instance, in a uh, living room or maybe an AV room because this is designed to help provide an internet connection to your uh, television, home theater, or other uh, devices. Let me flip it right side up for you guys. Uh, as you can see here at the top, uh, the different Ethernet ports on this device actually have different priorities. So you have uh, number one here, which is high priority, and it goes down to low priority. So if you have one device that you'd like it to prioritize over the other, uh, using quality of service, you can actually plug it into port number one here, which corresponds to those ports there on the back, and that will prioritize that over other devices that are plugged in. You also have a security button right there, and when you initially set up the, this device, you use the security button to pair uh, this power line adapter with the AV500 adapter. You also have uh, a restore factory default settings uh, right there that you can use a paper, paper clip to push that in, and finally you got your AC power port. 
And that's going to wrap it up for this video. Once again, this has been the Netgear XAVB5004 Universal Powerline Internet Adapter Kit. I'm Paul with Newegg TV. If you enjoyed today's video, please head over to our Newegg YouTube channel for more tech videos. Thanks a lot for watching, and we'll see you next time.